Hundreds of people came together at Cal Expo today to pay tribute to the victims and honor the survivors of 9-11. The September 11th Memorial Plaza brought people from near and far to the capital city. KCRA 3's Leticia Ordaz shows us how the community is remembering the anniversary of the terror attacks 21 years later. When I come here, I just am a mess. Melanie Coppin now lives in Sacramento, but when 9-11 happened, she lived in New York with her young children. And I got an alert on my phone that the streets were locked down and that I couldn't couldn't leave. And my first thought was my oldest was in kindergarten and I wanted to go get him and they wouldn't let me. Later that day, she found out her cousin Laura Morbido was on American Airlines Flight 11. Hijackers crashed the plane into the North Tower of the World Trade Center, killing everyone on board. Never, ever forget that I'm sorry and that we're with you every day. The September 11th Memorial Plaza at Cal Expo is a place of comfort and mourning for many. I have to say I'm so proud of our town here because we uh, we are honoring in this beautiful area of Cal Expo this um, gorgeous uh, globe and all the different pieces of New York that are here. And this will be a, an important piece to help us never forget locally. This 9-11 memorial has been at Cal Expo for 19 years. Hundreds of people stopped by today, but you can actually visit it year round. Congressman Ami Berra attended today's ceremony in Sacramento. It's a day for us to remember. It really was an attack on our freedoms, what we represent as the United States. And yeah, you know, we shouldn't forget. We should make sure our children and um, the generations that weren't born on 9-11 continue to remember that. The sacrifices that were paid, the, you know, the first responders, the men and women that stepped up to, to serve our country. 21 years later, the capital city vows to always remember. We don't want to repeat history, right? So if you remember, maybe we can learn something from it. In Sacramento, Leticia Ordaz, KCL Ray 3 News. And in Rockland, Patriot Day honored first responders at Quarry Park. There were fire evacuations, K-9 unit and police drone demonstrations. Chaplain Mindy Russell, who was sent to work at Ground Zero right after 9-11, was also there. And in Sacramento, Intercom High School students honored the lives lost on 9-11 by doing a stair climb. We have some video of that event you can see here. 27 students volunteered to climb more than 60 flights of stairs.